Hello again, Craig Jacobson with River of Life, Lola Ministries, and uh, got one more revelation for you. And uh, God was showing me lots of things over the last few days, but uh, he reminded me of months and months ago when I was in, a, about a year and a half ago actually, I was in the, the west side of Chicago at this hotel, and I was looking out over this beautiful parking lot, huge parking lot, and green forest everywhere, and you could see Chicago skyline off in the distance. Well, there's this man walking across the parking lot. He was pretty far away, so he's a little dot. And God dropped in my spirit. All of my kingdom's in him, and everything he is is inside that man. It really just amazed me the more I started to think about it. All that expanse, all of his creation, all God that God is, all of his kingdom, all of his goodness, all of himself is in us because of what Jesus did. And uh, it's one of those truths that's so big. That Jesus has to say verily, verily, for us to believe it. But he promises we'll do works like him. In fact, greater works on the earth because we have his spirit. So I then asked God, I said, well, if you're in me and I'm, in, and you're, I'm containing you, does that make me greater than you? You know, because it didn't make sense to me. But he said, no, you're thinking about it wrong. You and I are one. You don't add anything to what God is. You just do what God says. You're his servant. You're also his son. And you serve others by the power of his spirit in you. Not by might, not by power, but by his spirit. So you're not adding anything to it. It's like Uzzah when he went to touch the ark and it killed him instantly. You don't try to help God. You don't try to add anything to it. Because what you're doing is saying, I am greater than God. When you add your bit to God's bit. So I ask my prayer today. I declare it's God 100% what he did for you. You don't have to add a thing to it, and you have his entire kingdom is in you now. That's what Luke said. All of his kingdoms in you, all of his goodness is in you, all of his spirits in you, and all of it was won and sealed by the blood of Jesus. So I pray that over you today. That's who you are. You don't have to add a thing to it. You can just roll with it. You can just live with it. You can just be Jesus and act out his will and his spirit and his goodness on this earth, and then you can go forth and bless the whole world. And you'll do it in his rest because he loves you. In Jesus' name.